If you're watching this, you probably already watched the video where I explain how to find the stronghold using mats. A video which, by the way, some people liked, some others didn't. Some people said funny things about it. But there was a small group of people who wanted a step-by-step -step explanation. And that was what I'm gonna be doing today. First, I'm gonna explain it thoroughly. And then I'm gonna summarize it for those who want just a short and easy to follow guide. So basically, the Minecraft wall is divided into two sides from the player's point of view when facing south. On one side, it goes from 0 to 180 degrees. And on the other side, it goes from 0 to minus 180 degrees. Having that in mind, we can use trigonometry to calculate where the stronghold is. And if you're not quite good at maths, don't worry about it. You just have to know some values and put them on some equations I'll give you throughout the video. So, in Java Edition, press F3 to see the coordinates. This value here is the angle I just told you about a few moments ago. So, throw an eye of enter and look directly at it to know our first angle. Now move 40 blocks in any direction. Throw another eye of enter and look at it again. That's our second angle. Now we can know the third angle by the difference between the first two angles. By the way, when using your calculator, don't forget to use parentheses. Otherwise, you may get a wrong result. Oh, and also don't forget to switch the calculator to degrees. Alright, since we already know how many blocks there are between the first two angles and the third angle's value, we can use this equation to calculate the distance to the stronghold. But there's a problem here. This value is expressed on block size, and each block is 1 meter by 1 meter. So to get its actual value, we've got to multiply by this. Or, to make things easier, we can use this equation instead of those last two equations. By replacing our values in the equation, we get that we are 1809 blocks away from the stronghold. Now we use this equation to calculate the number of blocks we have to move in that direction, and this other one to know how many blocks we have to move in this other direction. Because the angles we use aren't 100% accurate, there's a margin of error, it's around 0.5%. So, in this case, there's a matching of error of 10 blocks. So, once you get to the coordinates, throw another eye of enter to know exactly where it is and dig right below your feet. Et voila! So, to summarize, throw an eye of enter and look at it. That's your first angle. Move 40 blocks in any direction. Throw another eye of enter and look at it again. That's your second angle. Calculate the third angle. Calculate the distance. Calculate the coordinates. Calculate the blocks and kill the dragon.